Hi, I'm Josh Reimer. And I'm Owen Clark. And today we're going to show you how to update the look of a pair of boring boots with an old or torn jacket. And you won't even need to sew it. For this fun and unique way to update the look of your boots, you're going to need the boots, of course, a jacket, some scissors, a measuring tape, a felt marker, a paper plate and toothpick, and some speed sew. Oh, and what do you call a dinosaur that wears a cowboy hat and boots? Tyrannosaurus Tex. Uh. So the first thing we're going to do is prepare our sleeves to cut them. So you're going to need a few inches going down into the boot and then a few inches sticking up that we can roll over for the cuffs. So we're going to measure about 12 inches and then mark that off with the felt marker. Oh, and what did the boot say to the cowboy? You ride, I'll go on foot. You put boots on a foot. Yes. Once you've got it all marked off, just take the scissors and cut off each arm, and then you can set aside the rest of the jacket for other projects. Knock, knock. Who's there? Ben. Ben who? Bend down and tie up your boots. Ooh. So now you just take one of the sleeves and flip it inside out, and you're going to add some speed sew along the edge. And once you've got it all the way around the sleeve, you just carefully stick the sleeve inside the boot about halfway down. And then you just do the same with the other sleeve. Oh, and my mom once told me that I should put on a clean pair of socks every day. By the end of the week, I couldn't even fit my boots on anymore. Oh, <laughs> that's a lot of socks. <laughs> Next, you just take one of the boots and fold over the top of the sleeve twice so that you've got a cuff going around the top of the boot and then just do the same thing with the other boot as well. Knock, knock. Who's there? Emma. Emma who? Emma cracking you up with these jokes? Apparently not. <laughs> <laughs> not at all. And finally, if you really want to make sure that these cuffs are secure, you can take some speed sew and put it on your paper plate, and then with the toothpick, add it underneath the cuff, um, just making sure that it all stays in place and it's glued securely. I think I'll just use my fingers since we don't have to be too careful. Whatever you like. It's non-toxic. My mom once noticed that I had mixed up my boots when I put them on and she said, sweetie, you've got them on the wrong feet. And I just looked at her and said, mom, these are the only feet I have. And there you have it. Now your boring black boots have a lot more style and some pizzazz. These definitely do look a lot nicer. Yeah, now they're a lot cooler and more unique. I'm Josh Reimer. And I'm Owen Clark. And we just showed you that you don't need to sew it. Everybody who subscribes to our YouTube channel clicks the thumbs up button and leaves a comment here down below on YouTube before the end of February is going to get a free tube of speed sew. And next month we'll show you something cool on how to update the look of a backpack. That's right. So check back then because we'll show you how to do it without the need to sew it. Bye. Bye. Oh, and why couldn't the boots go out to play? Why, Josh? Because they were all tied up. But there's no laces. Uh, well, they were all zipped up, but uh, that doesn't really work. <laughs> they were all cuffed up. There you go. That kind of works, cuffed. Yeah.